morning. So last year I made a public transport video on the Lake District, which uh, seemed to go down quite well. So today we're going to kind of take that a little step further and we're going to do it again. So we're going to use the bus to explore uh, Buttermere and Borrowdale and do a kind of a, a big loop again around the Lake District. So wish me luck because it could all go horribly wrong again. But yeah, let's go and catch the bus in Cockermouth and head over to Buttermere. Hey mate, one please. Two pounds. Two pounds. Thank you. I would have a nervous breakdown if I had to drive on yon roads, eh? <laughs> So here we are, arrived in Buttermere. It's a stunning little village in the, in the Lake District, but as you can probably see from the footage, uh, it's it's extremely busy. It's it's a Sunday in August, a sunny Sunday at that. So uh, yeah, it's extremely busy. So we're just going to have a bit of a wander, just been down the lake, and uh, yeah, just going for a. Half an hour bimble before we get the next bus into Keswick, hopefully. Right, bring you back in a minute. Really slippy. So I hope you can hear me. I've just found a nice little spot by the river. Uh, we've been down for a walk to the lake, which was really nice, although it's super busy. And now we're just sat in Buttermere Village waiting for the bus, hopefully, back to Keswick at about 11.30, I think. So again, fingers crossed, we'll see if it turns up. Thanks, man. Well, that was an experience. 
I'm gonna get a coffee and I'll tell you all about it. So, back in Keswick, well that was a bit of an experience coming from uh, from Buttermere. So we got the bus in Buttermere at about 11.30 I guess, and it took about 40 minutes to get into Keswick. I mean, the roads are just, well, they're not, the roads aren't horrendous, they're just really, really small country roads. And there was so much traffic on, you can see from the footage, all the cars parked on the verges and stuff. So um, it was a bit of a battle to get here, but um, was it better than driving? Yeah, definitely. Um, but what, was it a relaxing experience? No, definitely not. But you know what? I, I wouldn't even touch Buttermere in summer because it's so busy. But um, it kind of made it bearable on the bus. So we've we'll just had a bite to eat. And now we're going to go for, we'll go and get another bus back to Cockermouth where we started. So we're uh, going to have a nice walk through Kesey by the river and get the next bus and then hopefully get on. So we'll, uh, we'll bring you back when we're getting on the bus. Has it ever been nice in the town? Try me a cockamuff, please. Yeah. It's not top money. Cheers, mate. Cheers, mate. Thanks, man. Thank you. Okay, so we're back at the start point, which is Cockmouth, and I managed to park here all day for nothing. Well, thanks for joining me on this little trip. Going by public transport is by no means perfect, uh, because obviously you've got to work around the timetable, but in total, it cost me six pounds for the whole day, so that was Cockermouth to Buttermere, back to Keswick and then back to Cockermouth. So it was really good value. So maybe next time you're in the Lake District, you could consider using public transport. Like I said, it's not perfect, but uh, it worked fine. All the buses turned up on time and yeah, I was really happy. It was cheap as chips as well. So I'm gonna sign off now and get some air con on this car because it's too hot. So thanks for joining me again and we'll see you on the next one, wherever that is. See you later, thanks.